YouTube, what is up? Y'all already know who it is, man. It's DTV, and I'm back with another banger. And today, we got Nikki Glazier saving myself for Jesus. But before we go any further, I need you to do me a solid. If you could drop a like and a comment on this video for the algorithm, I would greatly appreciate it. Matter of fact, if you haven't done it yet, or you're new to the channel, go ahead and smash that subscribe button and join the family. Listen, I'm posting bangers on a daily basis, but are uh, y'all ready for this one? Let's run it, baby. Let's get it. Let's go. Hello. How are you guys? Awesome. It is good to be here in Montreal. I was just in St. Louis uh, visiting my grandma. Whenever I go see her, she's always like, you know, come hungry, because she likes to see me thin. Uh, <laughs> I don't even call, I don't call my grandma grandma. I call her Mimi, because when I was little, I couldn't pronounce old bitch. So that's what I came up with. Oh my it's God. That's a joke. She's so sweet. She wouldn't even hurt a fly, because flies don't understand verbal abuse. But... Uh, <laughs> 28, which uh, I just found out is the age where, as a woman, your body starts to tell you to have a baby. It's uh, my hormones are like, have a baby. My bank account is like, don't you even fucking think about it. <laughs> don't you do it. I did have a pregnancy scare recently, which, um, and I say scare because I was like, who's the dad? Uh, <laughs> like, Are you gonna have to bring Maury into this? Because <laughs> I fucked Maury Povich a couple months ago, but. Um, Cause who? Cause what? 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 Hold on! Hold on! Hold on! Hold on! Which, um, and I say scare because I was like, who's the dad? Uh, I was like, are we gonna have to bring Maury into this? Because <laughs> I fucked Maury Povich a couple months ago. But, oh my um, god! To call him up. She's good, bro. She's good. Like she's real slick with her lines. You know what I'm saying? I had a pregnancy scare. The first person I told was my mom, which I'll never do again, because she got excited. <laughs> yeah, she was like, oh my God, I'm gonna be a grandmother. And I was like, yeah, until Tuesday. Oh no. Which our horses, Nana. Soak it up. <laughs> That's what I told the doctor too. So that was, um, don't groan. Son. I just got back from the Midwest where you can't talk about that stuff at all. And, uh, uh, they have anti-abortion billboards everywhere there. I was driving across Kansas. There was one that confused me. It, it was just a big one. It said, thinking about abortion. I'm like, y yeah, I'm on a long road trip. <laughs> like, what else am I going to do? Can't text and drive anymore, of course. So... <laughs> thinking about abortion. But then three, like, 300 yards later, it was like another one that said, uh, consider adoption. I'm like, why would I want some stranger's baby if I'm gonna get rid of my own? Like, I don't get that at all. <laughs> right? That. Bruh. It's <laughs> I'm in a long distance relationship right now, which means I'm single. So that's, yeah, when the cat's away, the mouse pretends her phone died. No, oh my Every night. God. I can't do long distance anymore because it's all you have. All you have is phone sex, and to be good at phone sex, you have to be good at, at regular sex. And I recently found out I'm not because uh, I'm on the phone. He's like, "Talk dirty," and I'm like, "I'm just laying here." <laughs> Later, and I hung up, and that's all I've got. That's all I know. She that's said all I've that. ever done. She said that and in I, a, in, a, in another bit, unless. Unless the other bit I reacted to was clipped off of this one. You know what I'm saying? That's all I've got. That's all I know. That's all I've ever done. And I love it. I just lay back and get it. It's pretty sweet. Girls, do you know you can lay there? Guys will still fuck you. I've tried it out for us. They're like happier there most of the time. It's awesome. Being on bottom is the tops. It's pretty sweet down there. Once in a while, they'll like straight up ask you to participate, and it's it's a bummer. I'm not gonna lie, it sucks. It's a bummer. <laughs> but, like he bought you dinner at Chili's, you owe him. Like that's how I was raised. I don't know about you, but I felt obligated. It did happen to me recently. Um, this guy was giving me like a, like a really good rogering, and at some point in the middle of yeah, I like that. Yeah, phrasing. this is a this is a clip from um from another one. 
I don't remember which one it was. I, I'd have to go back into my channel to, uh, to, 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 to find it. But let's keep going. Let's keep going nonetheless. Because girls can't be like, I got fucked. Like, we got to say stuff like, I got good rogering. <laughs> Sounds classy, doesn't it? Sounds like he courted me or like I knew his name or something. Like it sounds <laughs> fancy. I like it. So he was, get, he was giving me a good rogering and I thought we were having fun, but at some point in the middle of it, I remember he was like, he was like, hey, will you get on top? And, and I was like, what did you say? Like he woke me up and I was like, what's going on? <laughs> I like rolled over. I'm like, I don't want to go to school. <laughs> But I did it, you know, I got up there, I took off my sleep mask and uh, oh my God. wiped the drool off my face. I hope it was drool and um, <laughs> I was really out of it. And uh, I got up there and I gotta give it up to you guys for being up there most of the time. I had no idea how much cardio that was right out of the gate. I thought I was in shape, no. It was the worst spinning class of my entire life. <laughs> it was awful. I was wheezing right away. Just winded. I don't know if it was like the change in elevation or something. I was like, this is like fucking in Denver. It sucked. I'm lazy. I'm bad at sex. I think that's what I've concluded. It's fine. I'm okay with it because I got a late start. I'm learning. I didn't have sex till I was 21. Uh, cause I was saving myself for Jesus, which I know luckily that was my gardener's name. So that worked out, but, uh, yeah, I found a loophole in my dad's rule. Uh, yeah, thank you. I don't know why I really just waited cause I was scared, you know? And, uh, and I, I think I only did it ultimately for the first time because that guy was the first guy to have a really good argument for why we should. You know, and I remember, because I was like, I don't think I'm ready. And he was like, come on. That's it? Yeah, that was it. Uh, <laughs> solid logic. I think he's a lawyer now. Thank you guys very much. I'm Nikki Glazer. Enjoy your show. Thank you so much. Yo, she's good, man. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. A lot she of people, a lot of people, a lot of people have been, uh, been leaving comments like she's whack or whatever, but she's not. She's on point with her comedy. You feel me? Let me know in the comments what is next from Nikki Glazier. And I get to her ASAP. But, yo, I'm going to end this video right here. If you made it to the very end, you throw MVP, baby. No cap. If you enjoyed this video, y'all know what to do. Make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thank you for watching, gang. I appreciate y'all. Love y'all. Peace.